Moscow is firing back at U.S. officials for reporting that President Putin has been in the dark about his military struggles in Ukraine. This comes as the Ukrainians' fierce defense appears to be forcing Russia to shift its focus to the congested Donbass region in the east. Fox's Madeline Riviera reports from Washington. Neither the State Department nor the Pentagon possess the real information about what is happening in the Kremlin. Moscow is sounding off, frustrated over U.S. intelligence that President Putin has been misled by his own advisors about his military's losses in Ukraine. They're shooting down reports that they have not been transparent. This complete lack of understanding leads to erroneous decisions, reckless decisions that could have very bad consequences. U.S. officials estimate 7,000 to 15,000 Russians have been killed so far. British officials are also citing new intelligence showing that Russian soldiers are struggling. We've seen Russian soldiers, short of weapons and morale, refusing to carry out orders, sabotaging their own equipment, and even accidentally shooting down their own aircraft. Now all eyes are on Mariupol to see if Russian forces will follow through with a ceasefire to let people evacuate. The city has been battered with attacks for weeks, civilians unable to flee. It was such hell. I can't express it. Anything you can imagine was flying through our house and past it. But NATO says Russia must be judged by what they do and not what they say. We see continued shelling of cities. And we see that uh, Russia are uh, repositioning uh, some of the troops. Meanwhile, President Putin wants to draft more than 134,000 new soldiers into the army, claiming they won't participate in the war. In Washington, Malda Rivera, Fox News.